Today we're talking all about the brand new diaper bag from Ayla & Co. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name's Nicole, and on this channel we talk about everything from bag reviews, product reviews, and so much more. So if you're new here, definitely consider subscribing. Today I am so excited to talk to you about this diaper bag because the features are unbelievable. The function of it is incredible. It is unlike any diaper bag I have ever seen. And that really says a lot because I share so many bags on this channel. I wanna thank Ayla Co for sending it over so I could take a look at it, review it, use it, share it. Um, and I cannot wait to walk you through all of the features because this bag is a bag that's super cute. It has so many neat features, but it also comes with so many extras. I'm gonna walk you through everything you get with the full package of the bag and then also um, one really unique feature that I've never seen on any diaper bag before. So let's go ahead and jump right in. Okay, before we jump into how I have it packed up, let me walk you around the outside of the bag first and show you the different ways it can be carried because it can be carried um, by these rolled handles as a handbag. It can be worn as a backpack, just like this, or if you tug this strap right here, it can convert to an over the shoulder bag, just like that. So quick, so easy. I typically wear this bag over the shoulder. Um, I find it really, really comfortable, really nice to wear. It does have this little padded piece right here with the name on it, um, and I absolutely love it. It also has a, it also has two little D rings right here um, because it comes with stroller straps, so you can hook it to your stroller as well. Okay, on the front of the bag, you have this really large front panel. You have the company name embossed right here, and it zips down all the way down on both sides, just like this. In addition to the zips, it also has two magnets in place. See right there? So it holds it. And then it has these great gussets that allow your stuff to stay in and not fall out. That is a quick look at what that pocket looks like. I'm gonna take you through it in just a second and show you the pockets and tell you what I have packed inside. Um, one of the things I love, I also love about this bag are the bottle pockets. They are expandable. So I personally am not as excited about bottle pockets that stick out really wide. And this one sits flush with the bag, but then you can unzip it like this and it opens. I will pop a bottle in there so you guys can see what that looks like, but see how it opens right up and it has kind of like that mesh. And then when you zip it up, it's hidden. So smart, so awesome. You get one on each side, of course. Um, and then on the back of the bag, there is a, another little pocket right here. Um, and this goes about, this goes about three quarters of the way towards the back of the bag. Um, and it also has a little key fob inside, right there. So there you go, that's in that small pocket. Also on the back of the bag, there is a long zippered pocket that goes all the way across the bag. That pocket goes all the way down to the very bottom of the bag. So really nice roomy pocket. I tend to put stuff, you'll see in a second, but I tend to put like paperwork and things like that that I wanna keep away from my children <laughs> and away from the inside of my bag if I'm grabbing for stuff. And I did wanna mention that the bag is made of vegan leather. It comes in a bunch of different colors. This is the brown color and um, it does have gold hardware and gold zipper pulls. On the zippers on the bag, it has the gold hardware and then also like a little vegan leather zipper pull. All right, now let's go ahead and jump into how I have the bag all packed up and what some of the amazing features are. Let's do it. All right, first, before we jump in, I wanna show you all of the accessories that come with the bag. So first you have this removable insulated snack and bottle pouch. So this little pouch can snap to the inside of the bag. I'll show you here in just a sec. And it's insulated, so you can put your bottles in there, you can put snacks that you wanna keep warm or cold, and it's totally removable. Love that. I mentioned earlier that it comes with stroller straps. This is a look at what those look like. Really nice. There's more. It also comes with this silicone snack container. It opens there on top and then kind of squishes closed, just like that. How awesome is that for transporting snacks? It also comes with a changing pad. And this is a really large changing pad. The surface area is, a, I feel like it's a lot bigger than I'm used to seeing for change pads. Kind of scoot it back, there you go. This 
backside is kind of like a suede material so that it doesn't move when you're trying to change your kiddo. It really stays in place, which is awesome. So that comes with the bag as well. And now let's go ahead and take a look at how I have it all packed up. Like I mentioned, the bag is made of vegan leather. It weighs a little over four pounds, totally empty. I don't find it super heavy or uncomfortable. Um, and in this very first pocket, like I mentioned, it is magnetic right here. There are these two mesh pockets, and in one of them I have my Touchland hand sanitizer along with a little lip, teeny tiny lip gloss. And then there is a little key fob in the middle right here. In the next mesh pocket, I just have a couple of pins, and then I think I have another lip product. Yep. And then, let me turn it this way and kind of lean it so you can get a better view. On the flap, you have two more pockets, and the pockets are numbered. <laughs> so you have little numbers on each pocket there. And I really love the gussets on there too. Um, when I'm out and about, honestly, what I do is I usually, I usually slip my cell phone in that mesh pocket because it's easy to get to quickly. Um, on the side of the bag, I have my Owala water bottle in one of the bottle pockets. Like I mentioned earlier, they unzip on the side so you can slip them in, so you can slip your bottle in and then zip it right back up. On the other side, I would normally carry my daughter's water cup, um, but I actually just have my hand cream in here instead. All right. Before I talk about what's inside the bag, I want to tell you what I think is a game-changing feature. The entire lining of this bag completely and totally unzips and pops into the washing machine. So if you have a messy diaper change, it's as easy as unzipping it, popping it in the washing machine. How game-changing is that? Let me take it out and show you. I went ahead and I released the snap in the middle and then the entire lining of the bag comes right out. How awesome is that? I think if you're done with the child phase in your life and you just want to hang on to this bag and use it for travel, you could totally remove the lining and just use this as a travel bag. Let's go ahead and take a look at the inside. You have double zipper pulls. They go all the way down so the bag opens nice and wide. It is an absolute dream how wide it opens. If you need to get to something quickly and easily, this is so good for that. So let me go ahead and start with what is on the flap here. I'll turn the bag this way so you can get a better view. So this pocket is made for wipes and diapers and diaper cream. This whole side is kind of your diapering station, if you will. Um, since we're not in diapers right now, I'm repurposing it. And um, But you can tell right here you would load your wipes in in a wipe pouch. They recommend one that has like a snap top. Um, and then you can put the snap top right through there and zip it. I am using it just as an extra pocket, and this is my mommy pocket. So I have my pill case in there. I have my little portable charger for my cell phone. I have soap sheets that I'm still carrying around with me, guys, even though we're still in COVID times. <laughs> um, my travel scissors. I can kind of grab the rest of this out. And then the rest of this stuff is lip products and a nail file and boogie wipes. So that is what that pocket looks like right there. Next to it, you have two little elastic loops. These are perfect for diaper cream. So that way, if you're changing a diaper, you got the wipes, you got the cream, and then you could put the diapers um, right down here in this mesh pocket. You also have another little elastic pocket if you wanna put cream or a bum brush or something in there too. In that tiny mesh pocket, I just have my Mina Bebe pouch, and this is just holding like little activities for the kiddos. All right, so that is that first panel. Let me kind of flip the bag around here and show you what is on the other side. So on the other side, I have my keys just kind of tossed in here, which is really nice. And then down here on the bottom, the pockets are still numbered, which I think is really fun. Um, so it's pockets six, seven, and eight. And um, I had gummy bears in this pocket. <laughs> I gave them to my kids earlier, Kleenex. And then in this last pocket, I have it totally empty. Um, but you can see there, you have that little row of pockets. Behind that, I have my Mina Mama pouch, and I'm using this as my wallet. So I have my actual Mina wallet in there. I have another hand sanitizer. I have some lip products, AirPods. And then of course, the Mina Mama pouch comes with like the little card case too. 
So I have that so I can kind of grab it out and run if I need to. Um, behind that I have a Jujube Be Quick. This is carrying diapering stuff for Elle just in case. Um, well, I should say potty training, and this is in the Party in the Sky print, I believe. So in here I just have a pull-up, I have a wet bag, um, I have all that kind of stuff in that pouch. Next to that I have a Sony Clover travel pouch, and this has all of my med supplies in it. So everything from a bug bite thing to Neosporin, everything in between, deodorant, all over ointment from Tubby Todd, it's all in there. And what I've started to do is take the little tiny pouch that comes inside the Hunter toiletry case from Dagny Dover and I fill this with all of my band-aids and little odds and ends. So that is in, everything's in that little pouch inside the bigger one. Pouches and pouches, right? But there you go. Right. So that is what I had right there. Then um, in this tiny pocket right up here, I have my foldable hairbrush. I thought it fit just really nicely right there. And you can see right here, there are the two snaps, and that is where you would attach the insulated snack bag that comes with the bag. So, you could take your insulated snack bag and just snap it in right there. If you need to run and go, you can just unsnap it and be on your way. So, so, so cool. Behind this row of pockets, there's more pockets. There's actually three more pockets on the opposite side that match it. Let me see if I can get in here. One right there, there, and there. So, so many pockets. Um, and then this pocket in the back right here is a long slender pocket, and that is made for a portable vacuum. You heard me correct. They sell a portable vacuum that can fit in the back of this bag to clean up after your kids' little messes. I think it's a genius idea. I've Never ever in my life seen a bag that has a vacuum. They'll be shipping soon So I'll be sure to show you guys that as well But this is that little dedicated pocket for the vacuum. So that is what I had inside of my Ayla & Co Diaper bag the ultimate most functional diaper bag I have ever seen um, One more look at that and Now let's take a look and see what it looks like when I'm wearing it All right guys, so that is it for the video today. I hope that you enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to give the video a big thumbs up and subscribe, and I'll see all of you guys again in my next one. Bye.